What's going on guys? Welcome to another tutorial in Adobe Premiere Pro CC. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to make your video black and white and also how to add reverb to audio. So let's open up this project in Premiere Pro. This is from my second channel, Adobe Easy 2. I have two panels open here, effect controls and effects. And if you don't have them open, you just select window and you can find them right here. Next thing we're going to do is scrub on the timeline to the video that I want to add the tint to. So right here we have the effects panel. I'm going to type in tint. Take this effect, apply it to the video, and we have black and white video. Command Z to undo that. And I'm going to type in black and white, and this does the same thing. So you can add either effect to make your video black and white. Delete that, and we have the reverb effect. And what the reverb allows us to do is add density and weight to the audio so it echoes. So I'm going to play this audio so you can hear what it sounds like without the reverb first. All Apple products, iPads, MacBooks, iPhones, everything Apple. Now I'll take the reverb effect, apply it to the audio. Go to the effects controls panel and we have individual parameters. Now you don't have to be an audio expert to actually understand what these do because if you make the adjustments, you'll hear the difference. So right here, we have the drop down menus for all of them and I'm just going to start adjusting the options here. Now let's hear what it sounds like. Press play. You will not buy PCs. You will not buy any other kind of devices besides Apple. So that's basically it. I just want to explain the reason why I was doing this on this portion of the video is that it was a character voice. If you notice, when I right click on this and select speed duration, it's at 90%. So what that also allows to do is alter the voice. You can do this in Adobe Audition where you're changing the way the voice sounds, or you can utilize Premiere Pro and the options that we have in this application. So it's really up to you on how you want to edit your video. But those are some editing tricks in Premiere Pro CC. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Of course, if you liked it, give it a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in the next tutorial. Peace out.